I think we both know she's quite the uh, lady, right, Bruce? She is. You know that Vicky is. Tell me what you know. I was drugged. The same drug the children of Arkham used on Montoya and Harvey Dent. You get me out of here, and I'm willing to testify. Would you listen to yourself? You sound insane. No. I'm just a man who's done letting assholes like you run the world and take whatever they want. Can't let you keep running around scot-free, Bruce. It's the will of the people. What do you mean, you're leaving? Bruce, Harvey's clearly lost it. All over the news, yelling about how you need to be brought to justice, throwing whoever he wants in jail. Not really interested in seeing what he has planned for me. Hmm. I was supposed to be here laying low. Does this look like laying low to you? You don't need to worry about Harvey. I'll protect you from him. Don't write checks you can't cash. What don't is you that get supposed it, Bruce? to Bruce? Harvey catching you in my apartment drove him completely around the bend. So you're saying you think his breakdown is our fault? I... Yeah? Don't hmm. get me wrong, Bruce. The night was a lot of fun, but... I hate the glare. For. Why the glare? It's a new... He's Why dangerous. the glare? You understand, don't you? Okay, don't you think you're being just a little overdramatic? Harvey wouldn't kill you. No? Look what he's done to you. And you're the type of person who shows up in headlines. He could have me killed and no one would ever know. <laughs> so where are you gonna go? I got some other business I need to take care of. What other business? <clears throat> Look at yourself, Bruce. You're it's in no drugs. shape to take on Harvey. Or the children of Arkham, for that matter. Of course. That's my car. Bye, Selena. See you around. Good luck with... all of this. Man, that pretty sucks how she left. But you know what? I can understand her viewpoint. She's in danger. Okay. I just need and to get to the computer. You're exhausted. Yeah. And the influence of Lady Arkham's drug may still be affecting you. You've seen the way it's still affecting Harvey. He's a paranoid wreck. Hmm. Harvey is turning Gotham into a police state. Oswald has stolen my company, and we need to find Vicky and the children of Arkham before they strike again. I can't just ignore it. You're in no condition to work. I know you that. You absolutely must get some rest. Then help me. Feels like the whole damn cave is coming down around me. Of course I'll help. Let's start by addressing the problem at hand. Okay, fine. Bruce, you look awful. He's had a very long evening. You're right. You're right. Let's just focus on getting my head clear first. Bring up everything we know about Vicky Vale's drug. I'm on it. If we can isolate the presence of the drug, I should be able to synthesize an antidote. Let's start with the DNA scan. Compare it to your DNA on file in the bat computer. I'll make the preparations. Yes, let's get this drug out of me because at this point. Alfred's right. I'm in no condition this to work like that. This is the refined sample of the drug taken from Officer Montoya after she killed Falcone. So, Alfred's also right on addressing the situation at hand, which is this thing here. Here's my DNA before the incident. It seems that the drug attaches itself to specific proteins in the genome structure. If we can modify the drug's molecular structure, we should be able to create a counteragent. A remedy, Once you've a this cure. Out, we'll have a working antidote. Hell yeah. We could cure others affected by the drug. No. I wish that were possible. It's based on the individual's DNA. We'd have to sample and decode the genome structure for each and every person to make them a cure. We don't yeah. have the time or resources for that. That's why we were lucky to have mine on file already. Well, that sucks. So, I guess I'll just figure out what to do here? Hold on. This, this is pretty interesting. Hold on.
<sighs> what do I do? It's like, oh. That wow. Should do it. I randomly just move them around and I got it right is what you're telling me? I'm surprised. Oh, I hate needles. This needs to be injected directly into the vein to work. I oh. don't imagine it'll be much fun. I fucking hate needles. Oh my god, ew. Ew. Oh my god, ew. Alright, hopefully this works. Fingers crossed. <laughs> It's working. I'm Hopefully back to that normal. Does the trick. It'll work. I feel better already. So, what are we going to do now? First things first, I need to know what Vicky Lady Arkham has been up to while I've been away. Search Probably for all children mad of Arkham recent about activity. Me. <laughs> the press is reporting that Vicky Vale is missing. Yes, and obviously the police have yet to find a body. That woman trying to get the scoop on you, pretending to care. Sounds like someone she I know. betrayed you. I wish things had been different. Maybe I could have gotten through to her. You always try your best, Bruce. She had her own agenda from the start. She was playing me the entire time, breaking me down. She wanted me in Arkham. She wanted me to feel what my father had done to all those people. Bruce. There were bigger plans than me, Alfred. Batman stopped her at the Skyrail station, and I can't believe that she isn't finding another way to use the drugs. Well, if that's true, she may be more dangerous than ever. I know, I know. I, uh, met someone in Arkham who gave me a tip on how to find her. A tip? Do you really think you can trust someone in Arkham Asylum? Do I have any other choice? toward your recent time there, of course. He knew that Vicky Vale was Lady Arkham. No one else has that information. I suppose that's not something we can ignore, trustworthy or not. Exactly, Alfred. He told me that if I want to know what she's planning, then I should visit her parents' house. Shouldn't be too tough to locate them. Got it. Right there. Damn, that was fast. That was Bruce, too before you head out, I've conveniently got fast. I call it a strobe grenade. Throw it at any surface and the ensuing light show will make you almost impossible to track. Perfect. Thank you, Lucius. Thank you. Least I can do after you invited me to come work in the bat cave with you. Bat. Bruce. Yeah. If you do find Miss Vale, please be careful. <laughs> You're right, because how do I know she's not gonna... How do I know she's not gonna try and stab me again with her drugs? So this is where it all started. Lady I'm inside Arkansas. the bellhouse. Okay, so move deeper into the house to get a better look. Wow. That's crazy. Is that her mom? Alfred, the veils are dead. One body confirmed that there is a lot of blood. Alert Gordon. Will do. I don't know how this is connected to the drugs yet. Whatever they knew about it, Vicky made sure they kept quiet. Oh my gosh, she gouged her eyes out. What the hell? Oh my god. Her eyes are gone. Stabbed out. That's disturbing. What the hell is wrong with you, Vicky? There's an injection wound on her neck. Same kind Montoya and I both received, but this one's much worse. Syringe. Seems oh. she hasn't given up her old tricks. Interesting. Is this the same drug? Yes. But this is several times stronger than the dosage I received. Maybe she's escalating. This seems personal. Something connecting to this one, obviously.
Same device, same drug. This confirms that Lady Arkham is the murderer. Okay. Um, I understand that she has a personal vendetta and wants to show Bruce Wayne how Arkham affected her family, but... Recent family photo? Vicky's not in it. It shows the veils with another child in front of an industrial office. Wow. There's a logo on the building. Wow, that's crazy. Is there any link to possibly... No, nothing. Okay. Um, Smash TV. Is there anything else I can take a look at here? Large amounts of blood spatter across the walls. It's not steady like arterial spray. Someone was swinging wildly. Wait, there's a slight indentation where something bloody struck the wall with force. Something thrown. Nothing I can see. For now. Let me see here. Ooh, what is this? I think I found something. Hair? I found a lock of hair. Anything okay. unique about it? It was cut at a downward angle. Probably with some force based on how clean the slice is. So maybe that hair has something to do with this? Nothing? All right, let me go and cancel that link since nothing is there. Um, what's this? A knife. It's clean. This wasn't used as a murder weapon. So why, why would it, it be on the, on the floor? Exactly. <gasps> oh, maybe this knife has something to do with the hair. Here's Mrs. Vale attempted to fight back with this knife, but only managed to slice through the attacker's hair. Huh. Interesting. So there's two links. Is anyone in here? Oh, oh Alfred my God. found Mr. Vale. Alive. No. Dead. He's gone. Ten hours at least, judging by the state of his soft tissues. Looks like a company logo. What the hell? The belt by buckle the belt? is covered in blood. Before he was hung with the belt, Mr. Vale was beaten with it. Wow. So, the belt buckle, this could be linked to the blood in the wall. The indentation matches the shape of the belt buckle. It must have impacted with the wall during the attack. Wow. And the company logo definitely linked to the photograph that is in the living room. The logos match. Mr. Vale owned an oil and heating company. Looking it up now. Yes, he's got a sizable warehouse in the industrial district and a fleet of delivery trucks. And now Vicky's got it. What exactly happened in that house? I think I know. After we stopped her at the rail station, Vicky needed a place to hide her supply of drugs. Her father's trucks and warehouse offered the perfect cover. Okay. To do that, she needed them out of the way. Damn. With Vicky Vell fully assuming her new identity on Lady Arkham, Seems like she didn't need the veils around to support her old one. Vicky showed up to attack her adopted parents, but only the mother was there at first. Miss Vale fought back and was able to slice off part of Vicky's hair. Vicky then subdued her with the same drug she used on me, but a much, much larger dose. Nearly lethal. She then removed the mother's eyes, indicating a deeply personal motivation. This was obviously some sort of vendetta. Sometime during this, Mr. Vale entered. Vicky attacked him with his own belt, striking with the buckle until he was unconscious and bleeding out. Finally, she dragged him to the closet and hung him with the belt. The blood loss got him way before the hanging did. That's horrific! 
She never acted out in such a violent way before. Well, she did now. Why would she... Alfred, I think someone's still in the house. It could Going be the kid, Batman. Signature. If anyone else is here, I'll find them. The pipe? Clear. Nothing here. Okay, the oven, obviously. So, what? Uh, upstairs, maybe? Anything? No. The log. So, the stairs, right here. There has to be someone upstairs. There's someone here, under the stairs. I told alive. you, the little boy, I knew it. Oh my god, don't tell me he... No, don't tell me. He heard the whole thing. He heard his parents being killed. <laughs> I'm so sorry, little one. It's okay. I'm not going to hurt you. I am so Sir, sorry. Is everything all right? It's a kid, Alfred. The boy from the photo. Is he all right? Aside from the shock and a few bruises, he seems okay. He might be able to tell me more about what happened. Uh, possibly. But if that's the road you go down, please do it with caution. Yeah, you don't want to traumatize him even more, Batman. Hey, it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be alright. I'm sorry I scared you. It's going to be okay. Y yeah Of course. I need you to tell me if you saw or heard anything. This is important. I heard someone say something. Something about drugs, fighting the police. I don't know who. I don't know who because I didn't see anything. I didn't see anything because I hid in here. Please don't send me to punishment. Calm down. Wait, why see, would... That does help me. Thank you. Why would you be punished, honey? That won't make any sense. Hey, yo, what's going on? Get down. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh shit. Well, hello, Batman. What a <laughs> pleasure to see you. Well, 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 Oswald survived. Let me guess. You're trying to figure out our next move. Figure out where the drugs are. Did I get it? Am I close? Pathetic. I've got these little bat traps all over the city. But I should have known a good double murder would be what brought you out to the open. Shit. I'm surprised that this guy survived my brutal attacks. Because I could have sworn I beat his face in, that's for sure. Let's go. Boom. Right in the center. Bye bye, penguin. The hell? What? The hell? Don't hurt that little boy! Let's go! See? There you go. That's how you do it. Are you safe? Were you wounded? I'm okay. Good. <gasps> oh! Oh, the body! Oh no! They're dead. Oh, shit. It'll be better if you don't look. Oh. I'm sorry. They weren't always nice, but they gave me a place to live. Wait, what do you mean by that? I promise. I won't stop until I catch the person that did this. They weren't always nice. Were they low-key abusive? You're the kid who saved Batman. And no matter what happens... No matter where you go, that will always be true. Look at that. And now I that kid's happy. Owe you one. Batman. Oh my god. He was the only survivor. Come on. Let's get you out of here. 
He saved me. Oh. Yeah. Jesus. It's not a pretty. Was this the children of Arkham again? Why would they attack a family like the Vales? Because their daughter Vicky is Lady Arkham. She killed her own parents so she could use their company warehouse to stockpile the rest of her drugs. Vicky? Yes. Vicky Vale, the reporter? Yeah. And so, who is the boy then? My guess is he's another foster child living with the Vales. He says he heard something about drugs and attacking the police. Can't confirm anything, but it sounds like the children of Arkham might be plotting something with those drugs against your people. Thanks for the heads up. Mm -hmm. The warehouse is Vale Oil and Heating. You should secure it as soon as possible. I'll get on it right away. What about you? I've got something I need to look into. Lieutenant, what's going on here? Securing the crime scene, Commissioner. Not anymore, you're not. I'm taking over this investigation. Who the hell are you? I can't risk you allowing Batman to contaminate our crime scene again. Really? That's right, asshole. I'm leaving. <laughs> and so your bat stunner just didn't work? That's right. I have a bad feeling it was no accident. If not for Lucius's strobe grenade, I'm not sure what I would have done. Lucius, meet me at the back computer. There's something I want to talk to you about. Be right there. Let's get a closer look at you. Damn. I no can actually look into the device. Adhesion regulation reads normal. This is amazing. Okay, so let me see. Let me rotate here. Come on. EMP functionality is all in the green. It should have worked. Electricity conductor, everything looks functional. This doesn't make any sense. There's something that we're not this seeing This is strange. Yet. This microchip is emitting a low bandwidth receiving signal, but it shouldn't be. Like the ones you shut down in the GCPD. Something like that. But Lucius had his eyes on the Wayne tag that the children of Arkham breached. This is something different. Amir, I really hope it's not a tracker, I this. swear to God. God, someone's found a way to get past my security upgrades. Not just someone. Oswald Cobblepot. I am so sorry, Bruce. If only I'd been at Wayne Enterprises. Maybe there was something I could have done. Damn. Oh, what a mess. That sleaze Cobblepot at the heart of it all. Cut yourself some slack, Lucius. There's no way you could have known. I certainly don't blame you for it. Well, I still feel a little guilty. Looks to me like he's introduced some sort of bug into your network. That's how he's making my equipment malfunction? For now. But if he keeps it up, he could completely take control of your tech. My lord, that would be catastrophic. Is there anything you can do? I can try to work on your firewalls. But if I do anything too drastic, he'll know we're on to him. You know what? I'm tired of being on the defensive. Why don't we attack him instead? I'm not sure, but I can certainly see what I can do. Thanks, Lucius. Uh, uh Bruce, Lucius, you're going to want to see this. What is Why? it? Why? Reports of Children of Arkham activity are down. But these efforts do not come cheap. That's why I am formally seizing the Wayne estate. So the corrupt wealth of Gotham's elite can go to the better purpose of protecting Gotham's common man. Fuck Mr. off, Mr. Wayne Harvey. has 24 hours to evacuate his property and turn it over to the city. Or he will be removed. You, you can't let that egomaniac throw us out on the street. I have to talk to him. Harvey is scared, paranoid, but he clearly views Batman in a favorable light. Then again, maybe talking to an old friend is what he needs. Harvey's Honestly. behavior is unpredictable, random. Who knows how he will react either way? 
I'm going as Batman, actually. He hates Tonight, me. Tonight, Batman saves Bruce Wayne. Yes, about bloody time. Hopefully this works. Don't screw this up, Harvey. I don't know if that was the right thing to do. Why did I do that? I just can't... I just can't second-guess myself. Bit of a strange place to hang out, isn't it, Dent? Batman. Huh? Oh, you scared the hell out of me. Well, it's good to see you. <laughs> I was just telling someone how much I'd love to get you on my payroll. You've gone too far. Leave Wayne alone. Wayne? What, is this about the whole seizing his assets thing? You're not gonna break my legs, are you? <laughs> or maybe you're just gonna make threats. Words out that you don't get violent unless you have to. Calm down, Dent. I just wanna talk. Sounds good to me. Good. I'll admit, I'm surprised to see you helping Wayne. Seems kinda small potatoes for you. Maybe you haven't seen the news, but he hasn't been the most upright citizen lately. Why should I do anything to help him? Wayne was your friend. He put his faith in you, supported your campaign. He betrayed me! He lied wow. to my face while sneaking around behind my back! Really? Now, Wayne is just another curveball this stupid city threw my way. Hill and his goons, the Waynes, the children of Arkham. I'm finally starting to understand, to see just how sick Gotham really is. To save Gotham, I need to do some bad before it gets better. What are you talking about, Harvey? Ready to go. Are you kidding me, bro? Do it. Wow. What a bastard. What did you do? Our Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. Man, we lost a bunch of our own guys the apartment next door. Jesus Christ. That blast was way bigger than you said! We must have taken out a whole city block with it! Wow. We stopped the children of Arkham. That's all that matters. Are you kidding me, Harvey? That's this is not... What leader does. That is not I what... Like I should thank you. Seeing as you did give Gordon that tip. I don't care what your end goal was. Even one innocent life is too high a cost. Then you're thinking too small. I doubt the police would see it that way. There has been some conflict with the police, that's true. Like Gordon. Oh, he really wasn't happy when I went over his head to get the location of the drug stockpile. Wow. But I had him taken care of. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? What did you say about Gordon? Harvey? Batman! Shit! Where is he? Now, hang on, Batman, hang on! I had to make an example of him to get people to respect. Gordon is on Gotham's side, Harvey. He's fighting for this city, too. Batman, I'm sorry. It's like I told you. I. Crime Alley. They took him to Crime Alley. Oh, shit. He's out of his mind. This guy is out of his mind. And here I thought we could work together. <laughs> Let's take a ride, gentlemen. What the hell is this? Mayor Dent says you're getting in the way of protecting the city. No. Dent's got you brainwashed. No! He's trying to help! The children of Arkham are out of control, and no one, no one is... So much talking, so much bullshit. Fuck all of you guys. This is like a dictator 1984 type of shit. What a mess. I know. Thank you. Batman. Save the thanks. And explain to me why I just watched half a city block go up in flames. Dent took out the warehouse with the drugs. The location that I gave to you. Are you accusing me of something, Batman? Just say it. Come on. Let's hear it. I only told you. 
Dent knows, so someone you talked to told him. <sighs> Who is it? I know we're on the same team here. So Who is it? leaning on me and let's figure out what happened. Tell me what you know. By the time I got back to the precinct, Dent already had the information. He strong-armed it out of Commissioner Grogan. I didn't even have time to scratch my ass before I got hauled out here. Dent's position makes him dangerous. He's persuasive and he has power. Dent thinks that what he's doing is best for Gotham. He doesn't even have any martial cigarettes. Law. I know. He's stressed. <laughs> there's no saving him this time, Batman. And there's no world in which he manages to set this right. There's no hope for a rabid dog. We need to lock him up and throw away the key. Yeah. Jesus Christ. This is what it's come to. Which means we need a new mayor. We have a lot of work to do. Everything is such a goddamn mess. But we gotta start somewhere. I know. You know your officers, Jim. Take the people you trust and start hobbling Dent's army. Get your precinct back. <laughs> you make it sound easy. No, it won't be. But if anyone can do it, it's you. I You're believe trusted. in you, Jim. I yeah. believe in you. Gotta handle this first, though. We will get through this, Jim. I'm glad we're on the same side. Same here. Lucius, what's the situation? I, I figured out how he's causing the feedback loop. How? He somehow connected a, a black box computer to your encrypted network. It's like a digital battering ram. If he keeps this up, he can smash through the Batcave firewalls at any minute. He'd have Shit. access to the Bat computer. And no, my worst identity. Of it, I'm afraid. Alfred? Mr. Dent is pulling up to the manor as we speak, and he's not alone. Already? No, 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 no. This is not. This is not what I want. Sir, are you all right? Penguin's hacking assaults are getting worse. At this rate, he'll have my tech compromised by the end of the night. Only place he could be hacking me from is Wayne Enterprises. So let's go. Well, I don't envy your position. Even Batman can't be in two places at once. Oh, go to the Wayne Enterprises or go to the Wayne Manor. Uh... I need to stop Penguin. You go to the Batcave and make sure Harvey doesn't find it. I understand. Time to go to work. Let's go. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.